Eastern Star Bilingual School recently hosted its third annual Culture Day to celebrate cultural diversity. According to the school general director, Almed Pectus, this much-anticipated annual event aims showcasing a variety of dances, cuisines, and art forms from countries all around the world. Eastern Star Bilingual School's third annual Culture Day to celebrate cultural diversity attracted over 2,500 people, including guests from the Russian, Indian, British, Brunei, Indonesian, Malaysian, and American embassies, as well as parents, alumni, and the general public. According to a school teacher, a total of 28 countries were represented, including Turkey, China, Russia, the Philippines, India, Vietnam, and Brunei. Each of the 28 countries were represented at a booth hosted by students wearing traditional costume and displaying food facts and cultural items from the particular country. At the Eastern Star School, uh, we have got a big event here. It is called the Culture Day. And we have got here nearly 28 countries from USA to England, Indian to Malaysia, Laos and Turkey. Every country is here. And students are going to uh, present their countries. They show their uh, performance, art, music, and they show their traditional costumes here. And um, it is a very big event here because the embassies and the parents, students and teachers are all together here. They prepare the whole countries. General Director of Eastern Star Bilingual School, Almet Pekta, said, adding that each class was assigned to represent a country at a booth. For a period of three weeks, students and teachers learned about the culture of the country to which they were assigned, ranging from social and geographical facts to the arts and cuisine. I feel very happy that to learn another country culture and to make a new friend with other students from another school. We are very excited for create uh, for decorate our booth. And we this year um, this is our first year for Laos Laos booth. Yes. We are really happy with this. Students and teachers prepare food, decorations, and cultural items so they could authentically represent their assigned country at their booth. The event began with a flag parade introducing all of the countries that were represented. Following the opening remarks, the school showcased a variety of dance performances typical of the many countries represented it while guests strolled among the various booths and sampled the wide variety of cuisines on offer. All in all, the occasion was a major success for all parties involved. Proposals for this event. The first one is promoting diversity and culture for our students. Also, our students get hands-on experience while they're preparing their boots. They learn by doing uh, they have their dresses, they learn the culture, they learn a bit of language, and they learn about the food. So the idea is to, to get them more outside experiences, different cultures. Also we have our uh, purpose for the community to show them that we are promoting diversity, culture, peace, so they can come and see different places. Uh, as you see in our uh, courtyard, we have 28 countries, uh, which they can just see different countries, different musics, they will hear different musics, they will see different dances, all at the same place, without going anywhere else. Students and teachers learn about other cultures and organize an event at which members of the public were also able to experience 
a number of different cultures. The event was attended by officials from the Vientiane Education and Sports Department, students, parents and other invited guests.